What is Node.js? Well, let's have a look. We have our typical setup, a client, so a user using his browser to visit our web page, and our server. The server and the client exchange requests and responses, for example, HTML pages sent back to the browser to render, and Node.js comes into play on the server. It's a server-side language based on JavaScript. Essentially, you could call it JavaScript for the server side. That is what Node.js is. You use Node.js to work with files, to access a database, for example, so connect to a database, send data back and forth, or in general, for your server side business logic. So any logic you can't or don't want to run in the client's browser, where you, of course, have less control and less security. So Node.js compares directly to Ruby on Rails, PHP, ASP.NET or Java, for example. So to all these other server-side languages you could choose instead. It does not compete with JavaScript in the browser because both uses JavaScript, but Node.js really just runs on the server. You execute different things with it. You run different code, as you saw on the previous slide. So why and how would you use Node.js then? Well, for the why we get a couple of reasons. First of all, you use JavaScript anyways. You use it in the browser because there is no alternative to it there. So why not also use it on the server and learn some new things instead of everything? Additionally, it's really fast and scalable. A lot of big companies use Node.js and we get a vibrant ecosystem with a huge community and there for a lot of third-party packages and so on. How do we use it? Well, you can use it standalone, just start writing some Node.js code, it's really simple. But of course, you can also use a framework like Express.js, which gives you a little bit more helpers and tools to build awesome apps. And in general, it's also something you want to have a look at. You can use next generation JavaScript features for writing this Node.js code because you're not dependent on the user's browser. And that is what Node.js is.